Assalamu alaikum. Essential grammar in use. Yani morphe grammatik dersine ikinci kısmı ya hoş gelip siz. Bu kısmımızda past tenses. Yani otken zamanga ait mazularını organamız. İkinci kısmımız 13 unitten başlayıp 14. unitke çe bolgen mazularını oz içi oladı. Bunlar was were yani to be fiilini otken zaman şakli uh, past simple uh, ve past simple'ni soroq uh, ve inkor şakli uh, past continuous otken uh, davomi zaman uh, ve iki osini yani past simple past continuous'ni bir gelikte takrorlayımız. Manışı 14. unit bol adı. Xoğb bu kısmımızın birinci mavzusu uh, was were demek 12 unit was were bu to be fiilini otken zamanı xisop, otken zaman şakili xisoplanadı yani emizar bolsa emizar otken zaman şakili was were boladı gelin bana bu misalge karaylık uh, now Robert is at work now Robert is at work hazır deyipti Robert is at work. Uh, at work işte. Rob, uh, Robert hazır işte. At midnight midnight degeni yarım tun. At midnight yarım tun de. At midnight uh, last night. Uh, keçi keç kurun. Uh, he wasn't at work. Mm -hmm. At midnight last night he wasn't at work. At yaptı. Keçi keç kurun yarım tun de. He wasn't o emas edi at work işte o işte emas edi mana shu mas edi emas edi o'tgan ya'ni was war ya'ni to be filni o'tgan zamon shakli hisoblanadi wasn't was not he was in bed he was in bed u deyapti in bed yotog'ida u yotog'ida edi ya'ni karavotida yotgan edi he was in bed he was asleep Asleep, uxlayotgan uh, uykuda de yana. U uykuda edi, uxlayotgan edi. He was asleep. Mm -hmm. Mana shu was war o'sha biror nima ni o'tgan zamonda gi holatini tasvirlab beradi. Keling bu yoqda qoidalarga va misollarga qaraylik va shunda yaxshilab tushunib olamiz. Am is present. Am is present. Uh, bu am bilan is was ga o'zgaradi. M is was past bo'ladi. Uh, ya'ni to be fiilini oddiy, oddiy hozirgi zamon shaklida ishlatsangiz, M is are bo'lsa, mana shunda M bilan is uh, was ga o'zgaradi. Uh, shunda past bo'ladi. Misol uchun, I am tired. I am tired. Men charchadim. Tired charchagan. Men charchadim. Now. Bu hozir bo'lyapti. Endi buni o'tgan zamonga o'zgartirsak, I was Tired last night. Last night. Min çarçegan edim. Gan edim bol yaptı. Last night. Keçe keç kurun degen. Last keçe night keç kurun. Keçe keç kurun. Where is Kate? Where is Kate? Kate kayarda. Now. Bu hazır. Ge kolatta soru yaptı. Hazır. Kate kayarda deyip soru yaptı. Where was Kate yesterday? Where was Kate? Kate yesterday. Uh, Kate keçe yesterday. Keçe de yani. Keçe Kate kayırdı edi. Edi degen man onu bir yaptı. Kayırdı edi. Yok ki. The weather is good today. The weather obu hava yaptı. Is good. Yaxşı. Today. Bugün. Bugün obu hava yaxşı. The weather was good last week. Mm -hmm. Oba hava yaxşı idi. Last week. Otgan hafta. Last week. Week hafta. Last otgan demek. Otgan hafta. Oba hava yaxşı idi. Mənə şücaydı. Sıla qolin. M is R ni. Uh, to be feeling otgan zamanı şak yasaş üçün. M is R ni. Was göz gətirib qoysanız bu oldu. İndi. R. R. Were göz gətirib. R. Were. Were. Were. R. Were. You are late. You are late. Late keçikken. Sen keçikten de yaptı. Hazırı. Hazırı gibi etdi. Sen keçikten. You were late yesterday. You were late yesterday. Sen yesterday keçe. 
Sen keçe keçikken edin. Sen keçe keç kalgen edin deyipti. Ya ki they aren't here. They aren't here. Ular bu yerde emas. Here bu yerde de yani. Here. Ular bu yerde emas. Now hazır. They weren't here last Sunday. Ular bu yerde emas edi. Last otgan Sunday yakşamba. Otgan yakşamba ular bu yerde emas edi. Xop. Menimcha bular tushunarli bo'ldi. Endi uh, darak, so'roq va inkor shaklini qanday qilib yasaymiz? Ya'ni mana shu tubini o'tgan zamon shaklini. Bu emizar bilan bir xil holatda yasaladi, faqat emizarning o'rniga was wornni foydalansangiz bo'ldi. Darak gap shaklida I was, he was, she was, it was bo'ladi. Endi we, you, they uchun were ishlatasiz. Were. We were, you were, they were. Mana shu holatda bo'ladi. Xo'p, inkor shakli I was not yoki qisqacha qilib I wasn't yoki she was not, she wasn't va hokazo. Xo'p, we uchun we were not yoki we weren't, weren't deb o'qiysiz. Weren't yoki they were not. Yoki they weren't. So'roq shakli, so'roq shakli ham oson. Was were ni egadan oldinga chiqarib qo'ysangiz bo'ldi. Was I, was he, was it mana shu holatda ketadi. Yoki were you, were they mana shu holatda so'roq shaklini yasasangiz bo'ladi. Misollarga qaraymiz endi. Ya'ni mana shu was were ni yaxshilab tushunib olish uchun misollarni birgalikda tarjima qilamiz. Last year Rachel was 22. Mhm. Last year o'tgan yili deyapti. Rachel was 22. 22 yosh edi. O'tgan yili uh, Rachel 22 da edi, 22 yosh edi. So she is 23 now. Mhm. Demak, deyapti. So demak degani demak she is u 23 deyapti. Now, hozir. U demak, u hozir 23 yosh. O'tgan yil 22 yosh edi. Mana past bo'lyapti o'tgan zamon uchun. Endi hozirgi uchun is bo'lyapti. When I was a child, when I was a child, qachonki men child bola, men bolaligimda deyapti, men yosh bola bo'lganimda, I was scared of dogs I was scared of dogs uh, scared degani scared of dan qo'rqqan degani scared qo'rqqan scared of dan qo'rqqan dogs hop itlar men yoshligimda qachonki men yoshligimda deyapti it, men itlardan qo'rqar edim qo'rqar edim I was scared of qo'rqar edim Demak, bu hozir qo'rqmaydi. O'tgan zamonda qo'rqqan, shu yoshlik paytida. We were hungry after the journey. Biz, we were biz deyapti, hungry. Uh, hungry och qolgan, biz och qolgan edik after keyin the journey. O'sha uh, anaqadan keyin, journey sayohatdan keyin. Uh, Sayohatdan keyin biz och qolgan edik. We were deyapti. Uh, bu <coughs> was were ni ma'nosi emizar bilan bir xil, faqat bitta zamon orqaga surib qo'ysangiz bo'ldi. Boshqa hech qanday farqi yo'q. Mana shuni yaxshilab tushunib oling. Asosan mana shu oddiy qilib aytganda o'sha o'tgan zamon shakli xolos emizar. But we weren't tired. But ammo we weren't tired. Charchamagan edik, tired charchagan. Biz charchamagan edik. The hotel was comfortable. The hotel was comfortable. Mihmon hona deyapti, the hotel, hotel mihmon hona. Mihmon hona was edi comfortable, comfortable qulay. Qulay edi, mihmon hona qulay edi. Xo'p, mana bu the, the bu aniq artikli. Uh, buni ham bitta aloqa mavzuda o'rganamiz. Uh, Shunchaki hotel the hotel mehmonxona deb tarjima qilib ketavering hozircha. Muhimi was ga e'tibor bering. 
but deyaptı ama it wasn't expensive. Mhm. Ama deyaptı expensive qimmat. U qimmat emas edi. Wasn't. Was the weather nice when you were on holiday? Was the weather nice when you were on holiday? Mhm. Mm Ob havo deyapti weather uh, was the weather nice. Ob havo yaxshimidi? When qachonki you were sen on holiday. On holiday degan ta'tilda. Sen ta'tildaligingda. Sen ta'tildaligingda, ta'tilda bo'lganingda ob havo yaxshimidi? Ajoyibmidi deyapti. Your shoes are nice. Your shoes, sening oyoq kiyimlaring are nice. Yaxshi, nice. Sen oyoq kiyimlaring, ya'ni tuflilaring yaxshi, ajoyib. Were they expensive? Were they expensive? Ular qimmatmidi? Were they expensive? Mhm. Mm Expensive qimmat, ular qimmatmidi? Why were you late this morning? Why nega were you sen eding deyapti? Late, ya'ni kech kechikkan eding. Late kechikkan degani. Nega sen kechikkan eding this morning? Xo'p, mana shu shu ertalab, shu tongda, bugun ertalab nega kechikkan eding? Xo'p, qisqacha javob berish short answers, qisqa javob berishlar emizar bilan bir xil, faqat emizarni uniga was verbni ishlatasiz. Yes. I was yoki yes, it was va hokazo yoki yes, we were. Yes, you were mana shu holatda. Agar yo'q deb javob bersangiz, no, I wasn't yoki no, he wasn't. yoki no, you weren't mana shu holatda. Misol uchun, were you late? Sen kechdingmi? Kech qolganmiding? Were you late? Sen kech qolganmiding? No, I wasn't. Yo'q, kech qolmagan edim. Was Tom at work yesterday? Was Tom at work yesterday? Tom at work ishda yesterday kecha. Tom kecha ishda midi? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Ha, u ishda edi. Were Sue and Steve at the party? Were Sue and Steve at the party? Sue va Steve uh, party bazm degani at the party bazmda. Uh, Sue bilan Steve bazmda midi? No, they weren't. Yo'q, ular bazmda emas edi. Xo'p, mana shu grammatika qismi. Endi mashqlarni ko'ramiz. Uh, where were these people at 3 o'clock yesterday afternoon? Mhm. Mm mana bu rasmdagi, mana bu odamlar deyapti, shu rasmdagi odamlarni. Kecha soat 3 ta kecha soat, ya'ni kunduzgi payt 3 ta qayerda edi? Rasmga qarab, mana bu gaplarni to'ldirishingiz kerak. Birinchisi misol uchun, Joe was in bed. In bed, ko'ryapsiz, uxlab yotibdi. Uh, Joe yotog'ida edi, karavotida edi. Ya'ni yot, yotgan edi. Ikkinchisiga qarang, nima qilyapti bular? Uh, kino ko'ryapti menimcha. Yozishingiz mumkin Jack and Kate shunaqa kinoda edi deb ingilchada yozasiz. Xo'p, ikkinchisi, write am is are present or was were past. Am is are yoki was were ni yoz deyapti. Am is are xo'p, hozirgi zamon shakli, to be ni was were o'tgan zamon shakli. Mana shuni qaysi bir to'g'ri kelsa gaplarga o'shani yoz deyapti. Last year Last year, o'tgan yili, year yil degani, o'tgan yili she was 22. 22. O'tgan yili u 22 yosh edi. So, she is 23 now. Demak, hozir deyapti, hozir u 23 yosh. Mana shu holatda qolganlarga ham o'sha emizar yoki was were ni mosini qarab Gapni tarjimasiga qarab yozasiz. Bu yerda 
Vozvor nanıqla bolish uchun osha ish harakat qaysi vaqtda sodir bo'lyapti? Shunga e'tibor bersangiz bo'ldi. Misol uchun kalit so'zlarga e'tibor bersangiz bo'ladi. Kalit so'zlar deganimda vaqtga nisbatan last year, o'tgan yili. O'tgan yilmi demak, bu o'tgan zamon bo'ladi. O'tgan zamonga was yoki were ishlatamiz. Yoki yesterday, kecha. Bu ham o'tgan zamon uchun. Mana shu holatda qolganlarni ham kalit so'zlarga qarab yoki ma'nosiga qaragan holatda bajarib qo'yishingiz mumkin. Unchalik qiyin emas. Xo'p, uchinchisi. Right was were or wasn't weren't. Demak, was were yoki wasn't weren't yoz deyapti. Dara gap uchun yoki inkor gap uchun. Gapni ma'nosiga qarab yana yozasiz. We weren't happy with the hotel. We weren't happy with the hotel. Biz mehmonxona dan naqa masidik, baxtli masidik. Yani mehmonxona dan xursan emasidik deyapti. Happy, şey baxtli xursan deyani. Happy with, biror nama dan xursan bo'lish. Biror nama bilan şey xursan bo'lish. Demak, mehmonxona bizga yoqmagan edi demoqchi. Our room, our room was very small. Bizni xona, our bizning degani, room xona, bizning xona was edi very small. Juda kichik, small kichik degani. Juda ham kichik. And va it wasn't clean. It wasn't clean. Clean toza degani. It wasn't clean. U toza emas edi. Mhm. Gapni ma'nosiga qarab, shu holatda bajarasiz. Was were wasn't weren't nashlarni qo'yib Mashqlarni bajarib bo'lgandan keyin har doimgidek kitobingizning orqasida javoblarni tekshirib olishingiz mumkin. 4-inchi mashq. Oxirgisi uh, write questions from these words. Was were, ya'ni was were dan foydalanib savollar yoz deyapti. Put the words in the right order. So'zlarni to'g'ri uh, tartibda qo'y. Late Uh, late you this morning why? Mana sizga so'zni shunday berib qo'ygan, chalkashtirib, bundan siz mana bu tarafiga qaragan holatda bajarishingiz mumkin ma'nosidan. The traffic was bad. The traffic was bad. Mhm. Uh-huh. Traffic degani tirbandlik, ya'ni mashinalar tirband bo'lishi. O'sha uh, tirbandlik was bad. Mashinalar tirband edi deyapti. Traffic o'sha şey, yo'l yo'ldagi harakat. Shu uh, bad yomon o'sha yo'ldagi harakat yomon edi, ya'ni yo'l tirband edi demoqchi. Why were you late this morning? Why? So uh, why birinchiga qo'ygan. Uh, Esingizda bo'lsa, keling shuni bir yana eslab olaylik, har ehtimolga qarshi aytib o'tib ketsam yaxshi bo'ladi. Katta aytib olamiz. Esingizda bo'lsa, uh, why, uh, how, when degan so'zlar bor edi. Mana shunga o'xshagan so'zlar havni yozdim men. yoki how much how often. Mana shu kabi so'zlar bor edi. Shular siz so'roq gapda ishlatganingizda doim gapni boshida keladi degandim. Ya'ni emizar bilan. Misol uchun why are you late? Nega nega sen kechikding? Nega kech qolding? Endi buni nega kech qolgan uh, eding deb mahkum bo'lsak why were you late deb qo'ysak bo'ldi. Bu yerda ham e'tibor bering, why ha, gapni eng boshiga chiqib ketyapti. So'roq gapda ishlatganimizda. Uh, to be in present, ya'ni hozirgi zamon shaklida ham oldinga chiqardi, bunda ham oldinga chiqib ketadi. Mana shuni eslab qoling, ya'ni bu yoqda mashqlarda kelganda chalkashib ketmasligingiz uchun eslatib qo'ydim. Bu yerda ham o'sha narsa. Why nega deyapti? Were you late this morning? Ket mana shu bugun tongda deyapti. Ushbu tongda nimaga sen kech qolgan eding? deb so'rayapti. Xo'p, ikkinchisi difficult your exam. Difficult qiyin your exam sening imtihoning. Mana shunisini men bajarib beraman. Xo'p, no, it was easy deyapti. Demak, biz bunga mana shunga savol tuzishimiz kerak ekan mana shu javobga. No, it was easy. Yo'q, easy oson degani. U oson edi. U oson edi deb javob beradi. Biz nima deyishimiz kerak demak, ingilizchada? Imtihoning 
Kıyın mı de deyip soruşumuz mümkün. Çünkü bizge bergen söz difficult kıyın your exam. Sen deyim toning. Şunu yazışımız mümkün. Difficult your exam olsa. Birge yazamız. Hop. Was your exam difficult? Desek. Mana. Sen deyim toning kıyın mı de? Mana şu yapımız. İkincisi ya cevap baladı. Mana şunun bilen bu mazuyumuzun ahırı yetip geldik. Ki yenge dersiklerde görüşkünce salamat bulayın.